So I grew up in Massachusetts in a very small town south of Boston, so I was in a bit of a bubble. My dad came to America when he was 21 years old from India to start a new life for himself, and my mom grew up in the States in an Armenian family, so both sides are pretty conservative. So around age 13, I just, I knew I was gay. So because I grew up in such a small town, I really didn't have the opportunity to meet other gay men and women. But around 18, when I was a senior in high school, I would take more day trips into Boston, where I would meet more people who were in my community. And I met this older guy, and he was very confident, and he had been out longer than me. He was so kind and gentle and sweet, and you know, sort of introduced me to all these great friends that I still have today. And it was great, so after a few months of dating, engaged in, you know, doing everything uh, sexually together and this was my first and I felt very comfortable with him and I trusted him so I allowed myself to do it. And I felt great about it but the only thing that sort of made me feel uneasy after was that there was no protection used and at the time when it happened I, I didn't think to say anything because I was so comfortable and I, I felt, you know, he knew what he was doing. It just doesn't have to be brought up and, you know, health class in my high school hadn't really prepared me for this type of thing. So a few days later, I went into the city to see my cousin. I had told him what had happened and that I was pretty anxious about it, that there was no condom used and I didn't know if I did something wrong and I sort of felt semi guilty. And before he even asked me if I was okay, he said to me, Andrew, you need to go get tested now. We are going to Planned Parenthood. And I just looked at him and I was just like, what? You know, you, you don't even want to ask me if I'm okay. You just you want me to get tested? Why would I get tested? Do I need to get tested? Did I do something wrong? How do you know he had something? And all these really scary, dark emotions came over me. So he went with me to Planned Parenthood in the city. And I went in there and I didn't really know what to expect, but I was very, very nervous. I went into the room and talked to the woman and I just, I just sort of just like, was, it was like word vomit. And I couldn't form full sentences and I was breathy and I was really anxious and she just let me speak, she didn't interrupt me, and she just said, you know, it's gonna be okay, you know, this happens. There was no judgment from her, which was amazing. She told me what I had to do, she told me and taught me about safe sex practices. Planned Parenthood really gave me not just confidence, but it just gave me a sense of ease. It's just been an incredible moment for me to be able to move forward in my life as an openly gay man, knowing that I would have a place to be safe. So I'm forever grateful.